depressed, uh, people are depressed thing. Thank you. <clears throat> um, good morning, people of the press. Uh, please be seated. There are pa uh, plenty of papers um, uh, inside your desks to make paper airplanes. Okay. Um, and, of course, you can throw them at each other like the kamikazes uh, to remind you how many times uh, you, you were proud of yourselves after the Japs lost the war. Uh... <clears throat> I have prepared a statement um, to present to you all regarding the signings of Obi Melifanwu, also known as Obi Melon Fuckwad, <laughs> and uh, Albert McClellan. Uh, and here we go. Uh, these these two signings were made, I believe, yesterday, and um, might have been two days ago, but I think it was yesterday. Um, I think it was, I think it actually was yesterday, and um, we're very excited to have Obi. But there's a problem, and that's injuries. He's, he's had various injuries before. He's only had six tackles his whole career, which is embarrassing. He's been here for about two years now, um, and he only has six tackles. That's, that's embarrassing. So, um, And then as far as Albert McClellan, some of you might know him from your kids playing Madden. Uh, some of you might know him just from past experience of being on the Ravens staff and being part of the Ravens press conferences, and then you said, wait, these guys suck, so I'm going to go for New England, right? Okay. So, Albert McClellan is 6'2", 255. Obi Mellon Fuckwad is 6'4", 207. Uh, McClellan was an undrafted free agent in 2009, and Mellon Fuckwad was, um, uh, 6'4", or is 6'4", 207, and he is a second round pick out of Yukon, which is not too far from here, where we are right now, it's about 15 minutes away, who would have thunk, right, who would have thunk, an NFL player went to a college that you are 15 minutes away from, isn't that pretty cool? Anyway, not that you guys give a shit, but, you know, you guys have no emotions anyway. Uh, <clears throat> Alright, I'm going to read this statement. Here we go. Good morning, people of the press. That's you all. Yeah, no shit. This is a proclamation regarding the signings of safety Obi Mellon Fuckwad and Albert McClellan, the linebacker. I trust in these two, particularly Obi. Be that as it may, as I said in the beginning, um... Obi has gone through uh, assorted and distinct injuries. Anything from smoked brown-eyed willies to twisted Donkey Kongs to inflamed wing wongs. In spite of being apprehensive of these senseless or ceaseless and quite frankly bothersome injuries, we still continued with the signing due to his big size of 6'4", 207. We believe that he still has ample and sufficient potential to demonstrate and exhibit his talent when he was at UConn. Six picks in two seasons. That's pretty damn good, if you ask me. Uh, he could be a reinstatement, a restoration, a stand-in, right? He could be a successor to Chung or McCourty, depending on how long we keep him, and if we do keep him that long, if he can stay healthy. And prove himself as well. Um, as far as Albert, he is 6'2", 255, as I mentioned in the beginning, former Raven. He is mainly a pass rusher. He will most likely be on special teams. By virtue of these two signings, we will, uh, we will, need, uh, we will need to make two additional signings for the roster, uh, most likely releases. Uh, these moves will be announced later this week, as soon as we get the intel. In conclusion, we are stoic about McClellan, and we are comparably enthusiastic about Obi. Uh, we are anxious about his injuries, but hopefully he can stay healthy and bring volum uh, voluminous, meaning of great volume, meaning a lot of, uh, substantial, sufficient, and abundant subsidy and compensation to our doleful secondary. Doleful just means suffering. Uh, much obliged, people of the Fourth Estate and correspondence. Enjoy the rest of your day. Um, so that's my statement. Um, hopefully, Obi will do very well. Hopefully, he'll get some play time this Sunday against Tennessee. 
Uh, if he does, hopefully he will make a lot of great plays. Um, uh, and uh, Albert will most likely be on special teams. Um, we play Tennessee on Sunday at 1. This is at Tennessee. Uh, so, again, it's another away game. And hopefully we can win because we suck on the road. Um, so, anyway, thank you very much, people of the press. Thank you very much. I have to go to a press conference yet again, either later today or later this week, uh, to address the guys and to address Tennessee, even though I already did that last uh, last night, technically. So, uh, thank you very much, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you very much, people of the press. Uh, the injury report will be made probably on Saturday night. Saturday evening, Saturday night, or maybe even Saturday morning. But I sleep late. So, probably Sunday evening. Maybe Saturday afternoon, right? We don't know, but definitely Saturday, all right? So, thank you very much, people of the press. Enjoy the rest of your day. Thank you, guys. Thank you very much. Thank you.